the Chev got stuck in the Ford, got stuck, got the Chev unstuck when the Dodge showed up. But the Dodge got stuck in the tractor rut, which eventually pulled out the Ford with some difficulty. A well, more rain than we'd seen for a thousand years caused financial joys and biblical fears. It caused some smiles, it caused some tears, but more to the point of our story. For the first time in the collective memory, that old brown prairie that had been so dry for so long was very muddy, boggy, sticky. We'd pull one truck out and get another stuck in, and motors would roar and tires would spin. We'd sink right down, down to the diff, and we'd all take turns and do it again until no one could move. We'd call one more friend, come on out here, we need you. Bring your truck. Chev got stuck in the Ford, got stuck, got the Chev unstuck when the Dodge showed up. But the Dodge got stuck in the tractor rut, which eventually pulled out the Ford. And the Dodge, equal opportunity. Well, got me stuck in the mud, so I couldn't rehearse. And Chavez, too, has missed his work. Richie, he now fears the worst. He stood up his ex wife, she called him a jerk. Of course, Holtman didn't have nothing better to do. Except ranch. Chev got stuck in the Ford, got stuck, got the Chev unstuck when the Dodge showed up. But the Dodge got stuck in the tractor rut, which eventually pulled out the Ford. Well, it was truck after truck, we all got stuck, except the big old four by Hutter Ride truck. We all thought, Lord, are we in luck, but he wouldn't come anywhere near us. Mighty neighborly, mighty neighborly. We used a lot of our backs and a little of our brains We jacked up the jacks, we snugged up the chains We all did our very best to refrain from shoveling We put what timber we had underneath the wheels And we was all out of sand but managed to steal two sacks Of the best modern canola seed you ever did see That ought to give us some traction Chev got stuck in the Ford, got stuck in the Chev unstuck when the Dodge showed up. The Dodge got stuck in the tractor rut, which eventually pulled out the Ford. Epilogue. We spilled genetically modified canola seed that was genetically modified for control of the weeds and for big old yields of margin oil and raised hell all over that native prairie soil. Agriculture Canada is definitely going to be looking for us.